getting married. I'm not engaged yet, but we're gonna go see the venue today. Uh, the ring has been ordered. I may have had some, uh, I may have picked it out. So <laughs> insert a picture of Caleb uh, questioning his life decisions here after buying the ring. Yep, so we are gonna go look at the venue today. We have a date. We're not engaged yet, but we don't like to wait. You know? <laughs> we like to plan things, so we are going to plan. And so we're gonna go look at the venue and see if we like it or not. Of course, the battery's almost dead. It's the same day, I'm just wearing different clothes. Um, I'd like to change into comfy stuff when I get home. But we put a deposit on the place. We're getting married August 7th. 2020 we are going to do the ceremony inside it's not really a space where ceremony can be outside there, I mean there was like two options but they were like about the size of this room so that wasn't gonna work like they said the people would fit but I was like not comfortably so we're gonna do um, the ceremony in the middle part of the main room and if you saw from the video that is all like a glass building essentially and so um, even if it rains that day, we are set, everything's inside, so that'll be really nice. So, I'm looking forward to it. Um, we have a lot of planning to do, but a lot of it has to go through them, so... Which is not my favorite, but just because I'd rather just get things going and get things figured out now and not have to, like, wait um, to get them ordered or whatever we need to do. But I'm looking forward to it. We're getting into the depths of wedding planning and... Not sure how much of it I will film, but it'll be fun to look back on, at least for myself or the people involved, like my mom. So um, that's kind of why I'm vlog vlogging the whole thing. So, yep, that is probably part one is getting the venue at some point. Maybe I'll get engaged. We'll see how that goes. I'm assuming I will. So I uh, assume too that the uh, ring will be here in like the next two weeks because we ordered it online. So after that and before Thanksgiving, I think I will be engaged just guessing so so it is a few days after we went and booked the venue I don't know if I ever said that we officially put money down on the venue we're getting married on August 7th which is a Friday a few days later and I was talking to my mom about dresses and she's like well did you find anything you like and I'm like oh, I don't really know like I know I want a line I know what I want I just know what I and what I don't want but I haven't found like a specific style or designer that I prefer and she's like oh well let's go and look at wedding dresses not try anything on just look at them because I want like my sisters there and some of my maid of honors and maybe Caleb's family if he wants them there or they want to be there so um but when I actually find the dress but I do want to go look at dresses so I'm just like you know kind of have things figured out a little bit not just so walking in blind but and I forgot to film any dresses but I looked at some dresses I saw some that I really liked and I'm looking forward to trying on but I want to do that with my sisters my bridesmaids Caleb's mom and sister if they want to be there um so I'm getting excited this is weird I feel like I'm not old enough for to be a bride but um I guess when we are actually doing dress try on that we will uh I'll have somebody film or something so we'll see how it goes so ignore what I look like I've not been up for very long but I'm getting my bridesmaids boxes put together to ask them to be my bridesmaids. In a few days, we're gonna go dress shopping where I actually try dresses on. And then afterwards, we are gonna go have dinner and I'm just gonna give them these boxes. And so I just wanted to show what I did. Here is um, what the boxes look like. I already sent one out because my friend does not live in this town. This one says, I can't say I do without you. Will you be my bridesmaid? And this is to my friend Kaylee. This is for Caleb's sister. And it says, I can't marry my mister without his sister. And um, mine, for my sisters, it says, I can't marry my mister without my sister. So anyways, in each box is a mug that I customized with their names on it. A candle. Uh, two things in macaroons and then the eye mask and bath bombs. It was like supposed to be like a care box or whatever So I think it'd be really cute when they want to open them and just tell them that I appreciate them and um, If they want they can be a bridesmaid or maid of honor matron of honor. Um, I will have My one sister is married. So she'll be a matron of honor and then my other sister would be a maid of honor And all of these were cut out with vinyl through the Cricut that is how we got all of these on here. And like everything else was like sourced from online or mostly I think Amazon, like even these boxes 
they came like this and then you just put them together and they magnetize which is super nice and then i'm gonna add a ribbon and i'll show you that when i get that done so this is what the outside looks like i also printed off with the vinyl on the cricut their name so that we won't get each box mixed up um but of course ran out of blue ribbon my mom insisted that it would be enough but it was not um so yeah we are gonna have to get more blue ribbon for gretchen's box and then we will be done clancy already got hers in the mail she didn't have hers labeled because she uh will be the only one that's getting it mailed so yep these are my bridesmaid boxes today is october 17th and it's the day that we are going to well i'm going to go try on dresses actually try on with caleb's mom and sister and then my sisters and my mom and my friend Kaylee's supposed to come if she can make it after work. I uh, am a little nervous, to say the least. I don't like attention, and I'm already preparing for it. If you're a bell, that's my dog coming at me. Um, so yeah, I'm a little bit nervous about whole having attention on me, but I don't know. Also, like two worlds colliding in one day, and I feel like the mediator. And so like it's not like anyone's gonna be like in a fight, but I'm just like anxious about it just a little bit. So. Oh, you love to read the lid, Grudge. Mm -hmm. Oh! Mm -hmm. Duh! You ready, Princess? Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Do you want to see what it says? Yeah, why don't you... Sh I mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Wait, where's Nikki? Is she in there? She's getting zipped. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh! see the comparison for myself. Okay. okay. My hair's even moved down like this. Okay. So that's, she keeps getting mad at me, but it's supposed to look like the other one. Well, I wouldn't see for myself. What if it moves? <laughs> Sassy bass. <laughs> She's clearly the oldest. Couldn't tell. Well, when you get the other one on, I want to be able to see. Turn it around. Okay. I feel like this is like a little Okay. Okay, you. Uh, bridesmaids, get your uh, no. skirt down there. Fine. Said, mm -hmm. or the, mm -hmm. Nope, I didn't do a very good job with that. Yours didn't have a tray, did it? Yeah. Mm, not that long. Uh, mm. I'm yeah. short. So <laughs> still had a train. Uh, I don't remember doing that. Mm. I don't know. I think that's yeah. the only other one. Yeah. Look at me. <laughs> <laughs> do I need yeah. to. <laughs> she always makes me do that when I'm doing pictures of her. Huh? Yeah, I think so. Caleb didn't know what a bell was. I asked him if he cared, and he said, I don't know what that is. And then I told him, he's like, things that go over your head? No. You don't wear it like that anymore. But. <laughs> Yeah, that's what that was a surprise for Jeff. We told him no, but you ended up doing it. Yeah. Yeah. I think this is the one. Yeah. Not that veil, though. <laughs> <laughs> I like the length. I just don't like the... the it's too white and Um, I think it's just yeah. a plain one. Well... We are in Maui, Hawaii. 